hello my lovely kings and queens you are definitely welcome back to my channel my name is Pedroline for some of you who don't know me or if you're coming across my channel for the very first beginning of course I do talk about celebrity news gossiping trending topics etc etc I think I have to also talk a lot about African countries or any news that is like happening in Africa because normally I don't normally I never talk about such kind of news that happens in in africa i think i just have to talk about anything that happens worldwide so in today's video i am going to react to latoya forever so finally they are saying that the real wife of atlanta season 14 is about to begin and they have already like confirmed that you know like allegedly according to some sources they are saying that Latoya Forever, she won't be returning back. And it's so sad, you know, that, you know, Latoya Forever, she lost the pitch due to her behavior. You know, you saw that we all saw the way she was like conducting herself. You know, I feel as if, you know, she was like coming after her ex-husband. But the moment when she just met Van, she was like thinking, this is just my suggestion, my opinion. You know, you are entitled also to your opinion. For me, I feel as if, you know, when she, the moment when she got with this hungry van of theirs for fame, because Van is hungry for fame, he knows it also, you know. She felt as if, you know, she could disrespect the father of her kids and without knowing the consequence, you know, because without the father of her kids, she was never going to get a, a peach. So if she was going to try a little, a little bit, you know, like to be very humble towards her ex-husband, I think that maybe... Adam Ali, they were going to negotiate him and Latoya, you know, like to join the real wife of Atlanta. I think, you know, she was going to make a lot of money, you know, because they were going to go there as husband and wife, as couples, because normally on the real wife of Atlanta, they like to bring people who are like married and then they will want to know what is really like happening in their marriage. But for Latoya forever, you know, she destroyed everything, you know, because she was nearly to become very famous all over the world. Of course, she is famous here on, on, on YouTube and she has got a lot of subscriber on youtube i think she has got something like one million subscriber on youtube but the problem is just that you know the manner that you know our sister latoya forever i do like latoya forever don't get me wrong but the manner that she conducts herself it's so horrible for for tv i do believe that you know the moment when this lady was that she was going to get a pitch i do believe that it was going to be like disasters disaster but i think her ex-husband he was very smart enough you know like to to stop everything from happening because he never wanted like you know his life you know to be seen on on camera you know because they wanted to capture everything that was happening in their marriage what lead to their marriage what was the cause of the of the marriage to to end even though latoya forever you know she came on on youtube she, she uploaded a video trying to accuse her ex-husband of being verbal abusive and she accused him a lot of things you know like saying that you know the ex-husband he, he impregnated her impregnated her, her with the the last born knowingly so i don't know because she was like uh, suggesting that you know she was like drunk when allegedly the time when that the incident happened so i'm not sure about that and i do believe that you know as a lady i don't think that maybe there's somebody who can just willingly impregnate you impregnate you if you are not if you don't want to like to have a child that one i'm not sure about that let's just leave it like that so she won't be like uh, returning back to the real wife of Atlanta and I feel so bad about this lady because she was about to become a millionaire already Latoya forever she's a millionaire but the problem you know I just feel as if you know Latoya forever she should try a, a little bit like to humble herself you know because the way she just the way she was just like disrespecting the the ex-husband 
I don't think that maybe it's nice like that, you know, like to conduct yourself in such kind of a manner, regardless even if you become very famous or regardless even, even if as a lady, even if you've got a lot of money, you know, it's very important that, you know, you have to respect your partner, you know, but some other lady, the moment when they know that, you know, they're making a lot of money more than their husband, they tend to be very disrespectful and they can never even listen to their husband, you know, that's what was like happening, you know, to Latoya for Ava. I am just saying that this is just my opinion. I wasn't like living with them according to the way to the way they used to you know according to their video normally when we used to watch their video she, she was always like you know talking over Adam Ali Adam Ali could never even finish a sentence without Latoya jumping in, in the forefront you know to finish the sentence for him so even though she was like alleging saying that you know Adam Ali he wasn't like a romantic uh, Nobody knows. Maybe she's she's right. Maybe she's wrong. Nobody knows. So for me, I just feel as if you know she has to to chill a little bit, you know. And this vein of of his, you know, she has to understand that this vein of his, he's not bringing anything for her because right now, you know, he's busy cloud chasing, trying to make it seem as if you know they have broken up, yet they are still together, commenting on each other's videos, comment the pictures. And I don't know what's really happening between Ven and Latoya forever because I feel as if they're just like hungry for fame. They want to be like everyday trending. No, we are tired of you, Ven and, and Latoya forever. You can't be trending like every day. So my people, leave some comments here and give your suggestion or give your opinion what you think went wrong for Latoya forever to hold a pitch. You are entitled to give your opinion down in the in the description box. So see you guys in my next video and I hope that you're going to continue watching my videos and make sure that you subscribe because I'm always like giving you good content. As you can see, I, I upload videos like every day, you know, because I care about you people. So bye bye my lovely people.